Hey guys, welcome back to Dispatch Garage. So I'm at home, not in the office, relaxing. It's a it's a Friday, and today I'm gonna talk about uh, how much a hot shot driver makes. And I just uploaded a video, by the way. Um, what's on, what's not. It's an episode I do, and uh, every week, saying what areas are hot and what areas are not. So. And also, um, I did a, I was showing a load board and what kind of loads popping out out of where. So if you guys like that, it's, you know, so. Um, and also on Instagram, I posted at Dispatch Garage, I posted um, what kind of handgun should I get? And somebody recommended to look into a SIG and I never actually thought about a SIG so, but check it out. Check this baby out. I really like it for concealed carry. This is freaking awesome. It's a nine millimeter P365 SIG Sawyer. So, um, so, whoever you were, Thank you for recommending a SIG. And um, <coughs> so I'm gonna cut this in somewhere between the beginning of the video because I already, I already just shot the video and everything. So <coughs> the this is September 21st, 2018. And for the past three months, so 2018 update, it could change, and it did change. My last one I uploaded about six months ago. I I did not watch that video since, so I don't remember what I said. I was the average there, but um, the one I tell you right now is the current average of driver, and this is gross, uh, gross pay, not clean. You know, after all whatever spending you do. So, so yeah. Um, enjoy the video so let's get into it so I did the math for I got nine drivers right now actually I got ten but for the past three months I had nine drivers and for nine drivers for the last three months everybody averaged out at three hundred eighty five thousand dollars that's all nine drivers about there give or take so um, and this is keep in mind nine no, eight out of the nine drivers are non cdl drivers with 36 foot trailers 3500 rams non cdl um what else what else the details i could give you so you could compare uh, they um and mostly all of it was with partials it was not full loads it was partial line out of a truck so grab good paying partials and add on, add on, add on. And one point a couple of trucks are hauling four partials at the same time. That's grossing under 26K. So that means I could only load 10,500 about there with loads. So all of the load, it has to be lighter than that. And I got one guy that could scale 23,000 with the load. So gross is about 30, 30 some thousand. So he has a CDL and he drives. So with all of that combined, like I said, 385,000 for the past three months, divided by the, that by three um, and by and then by nine. So each driver made about 40 something thousand three months. I had a notepad somewhere, but I think I forgot how it works. So I'm going off my memory. So 43,000 three months for for one driver, that's average, I'm taking average. And then also, uh, so if you divide that by one, not by three, so basically it was $14,000 average a month, gross. And I would say that's a low average because there's a couple of drivers that took like a month off, another truck took like a couple of weeks. So it's really like, it's a very wide average. So if I would think of a better average, 
more accurate, it would be about $16,000 a month for a truck. That's for a better average. And this is, I'm talking about non-CDL. CDL truck is different. Honestly, CDL, does, if you have a CDL, a truck, you make a little bit more money, but it's nothing that you're like, wow, that's crazy money, you know? So, um, so that right there. And also, so right there, 14 to $16,000 gross. That should, what should, what you should be averaging out as a hotshot driver. Okay, also, I get a question. Should I buy my own truck? Should I open my own MC to drive? You don't have to get your own truck you don't have to open your own MC. First off, become a driver. Find a company that has trucks that you can, I mean, drive. If they don't have drivers, or if they're not hiring drivers, buy a truck and a trailer and run under their MC and authority. You don't have to go through all the headache to get, get your own MC, your own authority, all that. You could run, on their MC and their authority with your own truck. So that's like one of the most common questions I get asked. So, um, so yeah.